Raina's room. Go out with me, Koichi. I'm just a second-year high schooler who is always in the shadows. But now, I've been asked out by such beautiful girls. Alicia has long hair, and she is from upper-class family with a fashion-down skill and the traditional lot of flower legend. She is a perfect Asian beauty girl with looks graceful. Kelly has a short hair and is really academic and sports. She is a strong swimmer and she attracts and serious at competition. Some guys are probably there to see her in a swimsuit. I never expected this to happen and I didn't know what to say. So, why don't you go out with both of us for months for trial? Great idea! You can make up your mind after that. This was a house crazy must set it off. In case of Michaela. This is my line ID. Can't wait to exchange lots of messages with you. I never got a girl's contact today before. It was the middle of the class. Who could it be? It's from Kaviya-san. What's on your mind right now? About the subject, Wayne Club. I'll be happy if you are thinking about me. What sort of person did you think I was before? Wow, it keeps coming one after another. I put one more. I'll wait to focus on the class. One hundred message online? Why don't you reply to me? You don't like me anymore. I get it. I'm no good. Look at me, please. I love you so much. I was born to meet you. Yes. She started composing a poem. There was a time. I realized that Addison is male. In case of you. Can I borrow your smartphone? What? Why? I want to save my number in your phone. Oh, okay, Sam. Here we go. Thanks. It's in your contact list. I'll call you later. Holly didn't send me loads of live message like Alice did. My phone log at 11 p.m. I was about to go to bed. I wanted to hear your voice, so I called you. Well, thanks. What are you doing? I'm just about to go to bed. How about you? I was looking at the photos of you. My pictures? When did you just take them? I've been taking lots of photos of you, Koichi. When you were sleeping during classes, during lunchtime, at the sports festival, you come into school. Isn't that a kind of shot? Well, I want to know everything about you. <laughs> I know all of your test scores as well. Is this serious? If our says may help. I should call Kaoli, young Della. It was all bloody midnight. Ro was busy talking to Kaoli. <laughs> it's this time already. I have to get some sleep. Okay, but can you go to sleep without hanging up? Why? I want to listen to you sleep. I don't get it at all. A long message. Hang on. Here comes Alice's poem again. <sighs> the night without you next to me begins. Darling, will you be in my dream? We can chat through line, but I can't even hold your hand. I had to restrain the night to go with you. <sighs> hey, you seem tired. Yeah, I looked happy yesterday. Yeah. By the way, is your birthday tomorrow? Any look rest? Hmm, not particularly. How about going to karaoke with us after school tomorrow? Have a party here. I'll pay you share. Cool. Thanks. Tomorrow is Koichi's birthday. And then it was my birthday. That means. Who the hell is that at this time of night? Happy birthday, Goichi! This voice. Arisa, what's happening? It's midnight. 
I'm here to celebrate your birthday, of course. What? Here. This is homemade birthday cake. Thank you. You got a bandage on your arm. Did you hurt yourself? <laughs> I used a tiny bit of my blood as a secret ingredient. Barsa. Hang on a sec. Burns the legging. Koichi! Happy birthday! Bow your birthday present. Don't worry about it. Which would you prefer? Handcuffs or a collar? What? Arisa is at your place, isn't she? How do you know? <laughs> the thing is that your phone is backed with GPS. Arisa's be watching a smiley in front of me. Kaoli is on another side of the phone. I would not go out with an easier of them now, for I have the good of feelings that is there in our escape. Good morning, Koichi! Uh, good morning. The guy who is walking to school with these gorgeous girls on easy side is me, Koichi. I was asked out by these popular girls at my school, Arisa and Kaori, at the same time. I've been dating both of them as a trial for months. Hey, what sort of dream did you have last night? Well, it was... Yeah, I think it was about going to eat soba noodle with my friend. That's not fair. What's not fair? I always think of you every night. Why don't you dream about me? Oh, what? You say that, but it's beyond our control what we dream about, isn't it? If you love me enough, you dream about me. You have my picture and your pillow, don't you? She's a perfect Asian beauty who always looks graceful. The trouble is that she has a strong tendency of my head up. She wants me to think about her all the time, and I get lots of pine messages from her. Hey, you! Stop bothering my Koichi! Yeah, she's mine, but how is a not? I don't mind if you don't dream about me. I'm happy just hearing you breathing every night. How exactly does she hear that? Kaori is a star swimmer at school, but her true self is a young data girl who researches everything about me. You dreamed about being trapped in a cage at the zoo the night before last, didn't you? Uh, I don't really remember the dream from two nights ago. <laughs> but I'm pretty sure I had you sleep talking. Again, okay. how and why does she hear that? Now I remember, it will be a month since we started the trial dating next Monday. It is! Koichi, have, have you made, made up, up your mind yet? yet? Oh well... Why don't you go out with both of us for a month for a trial? Great idea! You can make up your mind after that. If it goes as it is, I'm going to have to choose one by Monday. What am I going to do? They are both too beautiful for me, but they are not normal. They are main hero and young lady. Today is Wednesday. They may start being very pussy by Monday, but against my expectations, it passed quite ordinary. How's that I got used to Arisa sending me heaps of messages and Kaori eavesdropping on me? <laughs> then, Friday came. Oh, it's Arisa. It's unusual that she calls me instead of buying. Hello, what's up? Uh, Koichi's voice. Of course, my voice. You called my mobile. Oops, I'm dripping because of your voice. Uh -uh. I called you to ask if you're interested in going on a date with me this Sunday. I've got two tickets for the aquarium. Would you come with me? Just two of us? Every time I went out with Arisu, there was Kabori. Is it okay just us two? Are you worrying about Kaori? She's okay with it. She said make sure Koichi has a good time. It's a so. Well... There is a high possibility that she will bag us anyway. About that, I have a plan. Huh? Two days later, we made up before we headed 
to the aquarium. Hi, Koichi. Sorry to keep you waiting. She looks just as cute dressed up outside of school. Shall we go now? Sure. Wow, what a big fish! They're going to take a penguin for work soon, he says. I would love to see that. This day has been rather more normal than I expected. I thought Larissa would make a scene as my eyes met the other girl's eyes or something. Huh? Why are you looking around like that? I just realized that I haven't seen any girls in this aquarium. Oh, that's what you were thinking? I asked my dad to keep females out of here. I don't want any females in your eyesight. Is he serious? Who the hell is her father? You say that you have a plan to stop being back on the phone the other day. Does your father have something to do with that too? Yes, he made this area a dead spot for me. Your phone must have nerve reception. She's right. So, we'll enjoy ourselves without any disturbers. Oh, was that better if I got rid of nails too? No, no need for that. Well then, let's go see the penguins, huh? What's wrong? Will you excuse me? I need to go pick some flowers. What? Oh, bathroom seamings? Sure. I'll be in a souvenir shop. Okay, I'll be back. I have to make a complaint to my father. A female has snuck in here. Hey, stop looking so scary. How did you even get in? I've even closed the border to protect Koichi. Protect? Sounds like I'm going to do something to Koichi. Well, you are, aren't you? Did you think Koichi is the only one I bag? What? Your plan was to take Koichi to see a fortune teller to hypnotize him, wasn't it? I researched that in advance and had the hypnotist put to sleep already. Koichi's happiness is all that matters to me. If it makes him happy to go out with other girls, I accept that. But you are no good. I can't leave Koichi to some bitch who doesn't play fair. I mean, do you really love Koichi? Whoever is okay with you as long as you can depend on, isn't it? Doesn't it have to be Koichi? Anyone who pays attention to you is fine, isn't it? The person you love and treasure is yourself. The truth is that you don't think about Koichi at all. I'm not like you. All I care about is Koichi's happiness. It's okay with me if his eyes are on someone else as long as that is what he wants. Well, we'll eventually get in the same grave, but until then, I'll let him do whatever he wants. That's why I keep eyes and ears on him all the time to protect him from any harm. You're just imposing your feelings on him. But right at you, I could let you go back to Koichi to continue the date. Ick! If you do anything to Koichi, you know what you get. I see it's taking so long. Her stomach is upset or something? Huh? Got a pine notification? I thought I have no reception. Koichi, I've got to go home. I remembered something I have to do. Tomorrow is the day for you to make a decision, but I'll withdraw from this competition. I had a great time for a man with you. Thank you. What's this? I never get what girls think. I feel I got dumped. <laughs> this is why I officially started going out with Kaori. One week later, Arisu started dating a senior. He asked her at first, but apparently, Arisu really likes him now. I'm sure that his mobile keeps getting notifications. Oh, can we get up in the bookstore? Sure, we can. I don't know where I left my favorite bookmark. I can find it anywhere. Oh, that bookmark? It's in page 158 of that right novel, Reborn as a World in Layla's House. What? How do you possibly know that? <laughs> I'm not telling you. My name is Koichi. I'm a second year high schooler. You might think that I'm bragging, but I have been asked out by famous beauties at my school at the same time.
One is a perfect Asian beauty, Arisa, who is also Mehera. The other one is a cheerful cutie, Kaori, who is also Yandere. I don't know if I should be flattered or not by this situation. I've been dating both of these intense girls for a month as a trial, but Mehera Arisa suddenly stepped away from me without giving me a reason. She started dating Kaneko right away, so she must have changed her mind. Koichi! Kaori, good morning. You always come to my place to walk to school together, but you didn't today. Were you disappointed? No, I didn't mean that. You seemed to deep in thought, so I was watching over you from behind. Is she reading my mind again? And was she shadowing me? Hey, Kaori! The swimming cloud bite wants you. Okay, thanks. I have to go. Catch you later, Koichi! Uh, yeah. <laughs> huh? I hear a whimpering sound somewhere. I felt butterflies in my stomach because I knew who this could be. The way she sobs, this must be Arisa. They asked me out before. There you are. I knew it was you. <laughs> go with you? What's up? I have the same question for you. Well, it may be weird to talk about this to you, but will you hear me out? Sure, tell me. I've been dating Kaneko, who is a senior, but he has been cold to me recently. He stopped responding to my pine and the other day, he told me that I'm annoying him. <laughs> well... I sort of understand how he feels. I'm not experienced enough to give any advice to her in this situation. Instead, I paid my full attention to her as she talked to me. It seemed that she felt better. <laughs> Thank you, Koichi. I'll keep trying. Hope she doesn't put her effort in the wrong direction. Koichi is such a softie. Well, that's part of the reason I love him. Hmm. How should I handle Arisa? I wonder if Arisa is okay now. A few days have passed since the conversation, but I still think about her crying face. Did I get attached to her after a month of dating? Oh, she's here again. <laughs> <gasps> oh, Koichi! Are you okay? What happened now? Well, um... What is that? Something caught my eye when she put her hair behind her ear. Is that a bluse? Is this from... Uh, that senior? Arisa moved her eyes side to side and gave me a small nod. The other day, he grabbed me so hard. Uh, does this happen often? It's not like he does it every day. Jeez. Koichi, is something bothering you? Kaori. Um, let me guess. It's about Arisa. You want to save her from her boyfriend. Something like that? You read me like a book, don't you? My reception is impressive, huh? Yeah, literally. I think it's better for Arisa to break up with that senior. Want Arisa to be happy. You're so soft-hearted. What was that? Nothing. I love you, including your kind heart. Koichi and Arisa may get close again if I leave them. I should do something. Arisa! Kaori, what's up? I'm hoping we can walk home together. Uh, yes, yeah, sure. Did Koichi say anything about me? Huh? What do you mean? I was thinking I would like to meet your boyfriend. Or you can just tell me where he lives. 
What are you planning to do? <laughs> I'm just going to have a little chat with him. Yeah? Who is it? Right. What? Where the hell? Calm down. All I did was tie your hands behind your back and blindfold you. W woman, what are you doing this for? If it's money, I don't have any. <laughs> I don't want money. There is only one thing I want. Get lost. Oh, I'm sleepy. Uh, Koichi! Did he do something to you again? No, he suddenly moved somewhere. I don't know where he went. What? But I feel liberated somehow. I tend to depend on my boyfriends too much. Do you? I'm glad that you are smiling again. <laughs> Thank you. Um, and there is something I want to tell you. Arisa! Kaori, good morning. Morning! Hey, can we talk for a second? In private? Uh, yes, I guess. Well, see you soon, Koichi! Interesting. They get along now. That's great. What were you about to say to Koichi back then? Oh, uh, well, it was just... Don't you dare say that you came back for Koichi, did you? If you say something ridiculous like that, you will get much more than just moving house. <gasps> oh no, I won't. And I won't go near him again. Good morning, Arisa. <coughs> oh? She ran away. Arisa started obviously avoiding me for some reason. Did I do something to her? <laughs> Don't mind her. I will sort any troubles out for you. I'm Koichi. I'm an ordinary third year high schooler. I still don't know if it's good or bad, but I got involved in a battle. Arisa, who is from an upper class family, and Kaori, who is beautiful and good in academics and sports, started a fight over me. But the trouble is the girls were Mehera and Yandere. Mehera Arisa has been keeping a distance from me for some reason, and I'm spending my days being loved by Yandere Kaori. Around the time fall comes, I was feeling gloomy and didn't know how to handle this feeling. Brace yourselves, some entrance exams have already begun. I wonder which uni Arisa is going to. Ah, why can't I stop thinking about Arisa? My girlfriend is Kaori, you know. To be honest, I'm missing Arisa's pine message attack. I had been receiving an incredible amount of message from Kaori, which even made me want to throw my phone away. One day, it stopped suddenly, and I remember I felt relieved. But now, I feel unsettled without them, like I have withdrawn symptoms. What the hell is this feeling? The sports festival is coming up. The third graders should be busy with exams, so you just do folk dance. Ah, we are high schoolers, man. The kid who just complained, I will definitely make you dance with me. I'm so sorry, sir. Folk dance, hey. I won't be dancing with Kaori since she went to a class for sports excellence to get a recommendation for her uni. The sports festival came. I'm guessing that those clicking shutter sounds I'm hearing are coming from Kaori's camera. 
This is the last high school sports festival. I have to record Koichi wearing the headband for this occasion. He won't know, but I've already set up a camera in his class tent. I can't check on him, even when he is back there. I will watch over you 24 hours, Koichi. Next program is the folk dance by all third graders. Ah, this is not my first time, but I still don't know the fan part of this. Oh, Arisa is coming up next. Her hands are so soft. I haven't really touched her much before. Now, I'm getting nervous. It's been a while since the last time I stood next to you. Uh, yeah, you're right. Oh? Huh? Did she just hold my hand tight for a moment? I thought that it was just me, but I held her hand tighter to check. She squeezed my hand back. Could she still have feeling for me? Since that day, Arisa stopped walking away as I talked to her. Which uni exam are you trying to take? I'm thinking about Lena University. Is that so? I may try there too, then. Will you? No, I didn't mean anything by it. Considering my academic level, I've been thinking either there or Eve University. Lena Uni, huh? It burdens me that Arisa will be there, but it's close to the uni I'm going to, so I guess it's fine. <laughs> I've got to keep watching him in university too. The final part for the exam began. I see Arisa more often since we are talking the same university exam. I realize that I'm developing feeling for her. When her Mehara switch is off, she's a gentle, sophisticated, and beautiful girl. Koichi, wanna go home together? Sure. It's no good staying with Kaori when I have feeling for Arisa. But a horrible thing could happen if I tell her. Wait. Kaori knows everything about me all the time. There's a high chance that she knows my feelings too. Hey, are you already aware of me and Arisa? Sure thing, there is nothing I don't know about you. She isn't upset after knowing this. It means she's okay with it, right? So. Are you okay with us having a break from each other? What? Well, I guess. Can't help it. Good. It got through to her. Well, this is it then. Thank you. I had a great time. Yeah, me too. Koichi is acting weird. Of course, I know that he is going to the same uni as Arisa. I can't give him a break while he concentrates on his study. I broke up with Kaori, but I tried to suppress my feelings toward Alisa to focus on my studies. I could let Alisa down if I failed the exam. Alright. I will do my best for university life with Arisa. Then, it was a day. The results came out. My number... There! It's there! Yes, I passed! We did it! Oh, I'm sorry. Me too, I was too excited. Is this a good time to tell her about my feelings? Hey. Well, I'm going to let my mom know that I passed. Oh, she's gone. The graduation day came without managing to tell Arisa about my feelings. We are going to the same uni but different department. Today, 
could be my last chance. I need to tell her. Hey, Arisa, can I talk to you for a sec? Koichi? Would you go out with me? Eh? But what about Kaori? I broke up with her. So, would you? I will! I'm so happy! Oh. <sighs> I came here to get the second button of Kawichi's uniform as a memorial, and this. I should have known better. My mind was too occupied distracting Kawichi's competitors so he could pass the exam. But I'm always the one Kawichi ends up robbing, Arisa. We held hands together. Cherry petals were swelling above us. I was so sure that my university life would be awesome at the time. My name is Koichi. I've just passed the entrance exam to my first choice university. The uni studied the other day. <laughs> Koichi! Arisa, didn't you have a lecture at this time? Yes, I did, but it's been cancelled. Apparently, the professor is sick, so I came to see you. Wow! Look at that gorgeous girl! Koichi is actually popular despite his looks. I hear that another beautiful girl was after him as well when he was in high school. Is there a rumor like that around here? Another girl must mean the popular girl Kaori, who is good at both academics and sports. There was a time when that beautiful girl and Arisa fought over me, but nothing to envy about. It turned out that Arisa is Mehera and Kaori is Yandere. You don't have any lectures now, do you? Why don't we go to the cafe? Sounds good. Arisa was Mehera big time during the second year of high school. But recently, she has been an ordinary uni student. After I settled into my new uni life, I studied a part-time job at a Japanese-style pub. Hello, how are you? <laughs> hey, it's me! Arisa? Koichi? Who is this beauty? Nice to meet you. I'm Koichi's girlfriend, Arisa. Girlfriend? How I envy you! It feels great to hear compliments about my girlfriend. Arisa came to the pub every single day that I walked there. Hey Koichi, wanna go for drinks after work? A new club opened recently. I'm interested, but my girlfriend is waiting for me. Oh, alright. Oh. I barely made it on time because of Arisa's pine messages. Good morning. What are you guys looking at? The pictures of when we went to karaoke the other day. Oh, sorry. We didn't ask you. You always say, I have plans with my girlfriend and can't make it. No need to say sorry. You're right. It's me that keeps saying no. I made friends with new people and co-workers, but I'm not spending time with them at all. Arisa, Arisa, Arisa. I'm with Arisa all the time and missing out a lot. Hi, Koichi. Here I am again. Uh, Arisa, I need to talk to you when I finish work. Tell her honestly that I need me time. This new Arisa will understand it. Sure, I'm looking forward to it. We agreed to meet at the fast food restaurant after work. What do you mean? Uh, I mean, I would like to spend some time with my new friends. You can hang out with your new uni friends too. Why do you say things like that? You're the only one I need. I don't need any friends as long as I have you. I always want to be with you. <gasps> you don't like me anymore? Is that it? No, I did not say that. Her member switch has turned on. I really like you, Arisa. But I'm a uni student now. I'm interested in engaging in things that uni students would enjoy. So, what's up with me? I said 
That's not what I mean. Here comes Aris's pine attack. I'm uneasy with the fact that I'm now used to this. Receiving 300 messages in an hour doesn't bother me anymore. I simply think that I need to recharge my phone again. It's a call. Huh? It's a manager? Uh, hello? I'm guessing the situation changed of something. But you were putting me in trouble living so suddenly like this. What are you talking about? Your sister just called, said you were quitting this job. No way, I don't have any sister. It must be Arisa. Would she go this far to be with me? Arisa, do you have a second? Goichi, you came to see me. This is serious. Stop taking my opportunities away anymore. Huh? Are you still on that? I do care about you and want to stay that way. But if you push me any longer, I don't know if I can. Goichi, <gasps> you will hurt me. Arisa, where are you going? I didn't follow her as she unsteadily wandered away. Hope she doesn't attempt anything. That day, Arisa didn't send me any time messages. A week later, a girl from Arisa's department talked to me. Hi, you are Koichi, aren't you? Yes, I am. Do you happen to know how Arisa is? She has been absent from lectures and I can't get a hold of her. Eh? Arisa isn't the kind of girl that skips lectures. Did something happen to her? I tried to reach her. <laughs> that would be great. Koichi! This voice... Kaori? What are you doing here? I'm taking a joint lecture that's being held here today. Forget that. What's up with you? You don't look well. This beautiful girl is my ex, Kaori. Hmm, let me guess. It's about... Arisa, isn't it? Actually, it is. I told Kaori about what happened between Arisa and I. Hmm, I get it. Do you want me to check on Arisa? She lives with her parents, so it's harder for you to visit her. Thank you. It will be very helpful. That night, I got a pine from Arisa saying, no need to worry. She said she just had a cold. Phew. I'm glad she's fine. Now, I got a pine from Kaori. I talked to Arisa. She seemed regretful about the trouble she caused you. She said she will control herself to go see you and send you pine. Is that so? Thank you for that. <laughs> if you need to talk, I'm here for you. As Kaori said, Arisa stopped coming to my workplace. Pine messages were down to only like good morning and good night. I acquired the time to spend with my friends. I started fully enjoying university life, walking at the path and hanging out with friends. I realized that I haven't seen Narissa for a while. I don't really feel that I want to. Should I break up with her before her mehera gets serious? Arisa, can I talk to you? You're breaking up with me, right? Thank you for everything. Eh? It was too easy. We were done through this very short conversation on pine. Same to you. Koichi! Kaori, you have a lecture here again? Nah, I'm here to check if everything is okay with you, Koichi. <laughs> Appreciate me. What's that? <laughs> Actually, Arisa and I broke up. Did you? You guys were getting along so well. It was an easy breakup, so I assumed that she was losing feelings for me too. I'll make the most of uni life staying single for a while. If that's what you want, glad that you're not down. Oh, Koichi is a real cutie. He has no idea about me. It was me that called his workplace. I know all the people in his department. It's time.
My name is Koichi. I'm in the third grade of Reina University. One day, I received a pine from my high school friend. Now, we've all turned 20. Let's get together and celebrate. High school reunion, huh? Everyone from the same grade is invited and the venue is a hotel. They made it quite a big event. I wonder if the girls will come. I went through a very unique experience when I was in high school. Two popular girls from my high school fought over me. One girl was from an upper-class family with passed-down skills in kado, the traditional art of flower arrangement, but she was mehera. The other was a very popular girl that was good in academics and sports, but she was Yandere. Oh, reminds me of those days. I messaged the person in charge of the reunion to let him know I'm in. On the reunion day, the venue should be around here somewhere. The girl over here, would she be... Arisa? Koichi. Long time no see. Are you on the way to the reunion? Yes, I am. Shall we go together? We used to date for a while. But I couldn't handle her mehera trade and broke up with her. It's been about two years since I saw her last. We go to the same uni, but our departments are different. I'm glad that you are talking to me normally. Why you say that so suddenly? Well, I sort of dumped you. So I thought it would be awkward between us. Were you worried about such a thing? We are fine. I'm fine, thanks to Minato, Takumi, and Ryun Ryun. Ryun Ryun? Oh. Is that your pet or something? No, they are my housemates. They are their hosts at the host club. They manage their shifts so that I always have someone with me. Isn't that very kind of them? Male host? Arisa told me that she went to a host club as her friend invited her to come with her. She was talking about her relationship problems to some kind guys, and they bonded and decided to live together. I also found out that she started going there while we were still dating. No way! We were having a break at the time, but I'm still shocked. What's the matter? You're so quiet. Uh, uh no. It's nothing. I'm not in a place to judge her. There were so many familiar faces at the reunion. It's exciting to see them all, but I'm kind of down. A graceful upper class girl lives with three male hosts, huh? Hey! Such a gloomy face doesn't belong here. Kaori! She is a beautiful younger girl that I had dated for a short period of time in high school. I broke up with her when I recognized my feelings towards Arisa, but she still listened to me when I had a problem after our breakup. What's up with you? No point lying to her. She'll see through anyway. Actually, 
I just found out something a little depressing. Did you want to talk about it? Wow, you finished it in one go. Isn't it too first? You aren't a big drinker, are you? Not really, but I can't get drunk at all. That indicates that whatever you found out must be quite depressing. Here, come this way. Uh? You wanna get drunk, right? There is an awesome bar nearby. It's open by now. Tell me everything over some drinks there. But what about the reunion? I'm not gonna have fun this way anyway. I followed Kaori and we left the hotel. I see. So that was it. <sighs> I would be shocked too. I'm not judging her about living with male hosts. Just it kind of ruined her nobility and innocent image. Sorry, I'm supposed to cheer you up, not feeling down along with you. You are all right. You trying to understand made me feel better. Kaori shows some sympathy to me. She always has. Kaori and I went to different university. But she was always there for me when I needed to talk to someone. Now what? You're smiling. Just thinking that you are a great woman. I see that you're finally getting drunk. Hey. Oh? Will that great woman get her second chance? What? I still can't give up on you. Can I be your girlfriend again? Kaori. We can start from being friends. I'll do my best to make you fall for me. But I probably shouldn't take advantage of you feeling down. Sorry, forget it. No, I won't. If you're happy with me, be my girlfriend. Koichi! No hugging in public. Oh, but I want to. I feel so calm now. I'm totally over the shock I experienced. Wow, now I'm calm and all the alcohol is catching up to me. Hey, Koichi. Hello? Uh, 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 where am I? Oh, you awake. Kaori, what? Did we? Yup, we did it. Just kidding, relax. Oh, I'm so relieved. Our first has to be memorable. We wait till we are both sober. After that, we dated for five years before we got married. I'm working as a salesperson for a stationery company. Kaori works as a planner at a travel agency. Our days are busy, but content at the same time. I'm home! Wow, dinner looks amazing! Hey sweetie, I have great news for you! Great news? Oh, could it be? I think you got it! Wow, I'm gonna be a father! That night, I fell asleep thinking about our unborn child. Get pregnant in the second year of our marriage, check. <laughs> it's going just as I planned in the future with Koichi Notebook when I was in high school. Oops! I forgot to check the task, plan and implement a high school reunion on the list. Uh... Oh, are you having a nightmare, sweetheart? You'll be fine. I planned everything for your future. Thank you for watching till the end. I will be grateful if you could subscribe and comment.